Hey everybody, Ben Fredrickson here alongside Dave Matter, introducing you to three Mizzou football names you're going to need to know. First, we have to tell you about Closets by Design of St. Louis. For a limited time, you get 40% off any order of $1,000 or more, or 30% off any order of $700 or more. On top of that, you get an additional 15% off any complete system order. And remember, you get free installation for any complete unit order of $500 or more. Call one 800 by design order today. Dave, the transfers are in. The signing class is complete. We'll see if more additions are made in the spring, but let's introduce Mizzou fans to some new football names. I'll go first. Tyron Hopper, the Florida linebacker transfer, big, upright, physical linebacker, likes to get in the backfield, make plays. I think he could be an impact player for this football team. How about a running back? How about Nathaniel Pete? He's a transfer from Stanford, uh, but he's a local guy. He's from Columbia, Missouri, went to Rockbridge High School, went out to Stanford, played there for three years, was their leading rusher this past season. He's got 117 career carries, more than all of Missouri's other running backs combined. Also a really good kickoff return guy. So I think he can add um, you know, some impact there immediately. You combine him with Luther Burden as a, as a punt returner, and all of a sudden you got something going there to help out in, uh, in, in special teams and uh, he, he's he's a, a really good addition at a position of need. You lose Tyler Beatty, you need an experienced back back there to help. Two impact transfers who should be contributing right away from big programs, so there shouldn't be much lag time for either Hopper or Pete. Dave, how about a how about a coach? There's been a new addition to Eli Drinkwitz's staff on the defensive side, who has an important job and could potentially have an even bigger one later. Yeah, Blake Baker is the new safeties coach. He comes from LSU where he coached linebackers this past season. Before that, he was a coordinator at Miami. Before that, a coordinator at Louisiana Tech, but still a fairly relatively young guy. He coached with Eli Drinkwitz at Arkansas State, so there's some familiarity there. And I thought most interesting was when Eli talked about him this week, he described him as a number two for that room, number two being behind defensive coordinator Steve Wilkes. Uh, maybe this is not necessarily a, a coach in waiting or a coordinator in waiting, but if Steve Wilkes should ever go back to the NFL where he has spent the vast majority of his career, I think you've got a guy in place now, Blake Baker, who could move in and be a coordinator uh, on that side of the ball. You wouldn't have to go out and, and find somebody else if he works out this year, but also known as a pretty good recruiter. So I, I think another solid addition to the staff. There could be another name to know this spring, Dave. We'll call him quarterback X, question mark. Eli Drinkwitz says that the Tigers could be open to perusing the transfer portal for a quarterback, depending on how spring football goes. Um, we talked a lot more about this on the Eye on the Tigers podcast, which you can check out at stltoday.com. Where do the Tigers stand on quarterbacks? They like what they have, but they could be shopping in the transfer portal too. Check out the podcast for more and keep it locked at stltoday.com for all of your Mizzou coverage. For Dave, I'm Ben. We'll talk to you next time.